When the Prosecutor General, Martha Imawa, finally broke her silence and admitted that she was unable to prosecute on the missing 600 million Namibian dollars in investments given out by the GIPF to certain connected individuals, Namibians were simply gobsmacked. In this episode of It's a Wrap, we bring you some of the unseen footage from that press conference. Check this out. Most of the criticisms are centered on the widely held belief by the public court that I am covering some of the politically heavyweights from being prosecuted for offenses of corruption they have allegedly committed regarding the money which was lost, especially in the GIPF matter, the social security or AVID case, the ODC, and recently SME bank legal scandal. The further speculative minds of some of members of the public have come up with so many theories which for want of time I cannot give an exhaustive list today. However, I perfectly well understand such developments because there has never been a response from this office. <clears throat> it is for that purpose that we are here today and I am of the firm belief that at the end of this discourse, some of the ghosts will be laid to rest. From the outset, I would like to point out that I work with a team of senior and experienced advocates in my office. The ones you see here, it's a fraction of them. Most of them are busy in courts. We work as a team. No one can overrule the ideas of others. Those who have knowledge in the law and know how the legal minds work, you know what I'm referring to. We are professionals. Let me tell you, a docket has to be perused and analyzed diligently and then decisions are made. There is no person in this office, not even myself as the prosecutor general, I can force my ideas on others. Every lawyer's mind is taken into consideration when a decision is being made. We make decisions based on the available evidence gathered by investigating officers, as you see them here as well as depending on applicable law relating to the issues being dealt with. It is not a solitary and unitary decision of an individual. In other words, a decision to prosecute or not to prosecute it's naturally influenced by the available evidence after all possible and diligent efforts has been made to gather evidence by those who, who are responsible. 